What's going on, ladies and gents? Welcome back to another video. It is your boy, Jnark, and we got something different. We're doing Ultimate Team. I put a poll on my channel uh, right there, and I said, no money spent squad, closes tomorrow. Got I got like two votes for yes. I was already, I already feel like doing it anyway, so we're gonna do it. Starting off the new year with some Ultimate Team, you know, and I was on it yesterday. I have made no moves, by the way. All I've done is open up these packs they've given us throughout the whole, like, season of Madden, basically. And that's what I did. And I'll show you guys what players we packed. But, um, ooh. EA Play January pack. This is a game day pack. Okay. Elite player. I'm on Ross St. Brown. Okay. Madden 23. Boom. 79 Rashad Bateman. Oh, that look fly. AKA 84 LaShawn McCoy. Damn, more elites? Like, yo. 78 Devin Duvernay. All right. One more elite. Daniel Brunskill is an elite guard. Well, I mean, that works out. But this LaShawn McCoy, you know, we're going to need him a lot. 87 speed. He has good catching, though, in the backfield. Yeah, we're going to definitely use him a lot for our squad. But okay. Good items that we packed. Um, yeah, as you guys can see, we haven't done a thing for um, for this. And yeah, we haven't done a thing at all. And look, as I, I, I wasn't lying to you guys. I wasn't lying to you guys. Like, this is what the team looks like with no touch and nothing. Like, literally. And we have 50 coins to our name. So, just, I'm not lying. <laughs> but I'm going to show you guys what... We do have, we have about 137 items, because yesterday, like I said, I was opening up the players, and we have all this. All these elites. Um, obviously, I'm thinking of running a 4-3 defense, and a spread offense. We have some fast quarterbacks here who, who are going to very much use, but um, we got this 89 CJ Ham that I don't know what to do with him, so I'm going to probably just sell him to get us started with having coins on the team um let's see how much he goes for he goes for about 39k so we're starting off we're starting off great starting off great get it ready gonna have some coins and stuff like that um let's see he just sold for 36k not too long ago um so we're gonna put him up for like what about like 37 i 37.6 i think that's fine all right so we put him to sell um I can't move this Kenny Pickett. I don't know if I want to use him, though, to be honest. Like, is he fast? Is Kenny fast? 82 speed, and he could throw. All right, that's not bad. I think we'll probably use Kenny. Uh, Hufanga's probably going to have to be used as well. We also got Von Miller, but he's not going to help out our team because we're going to run a 4-3. So I keep thinking it's LB to search for the auction just like it used to be in previous Maddens, but now it's the right stick up. So that should be fun. So he's going for about 13k. So we could probably sell him too. Start working on the defense and stuff like that. So uh, let let's put Von Miller up to sell. Unfortunately, we can't use him, but we just want to run the run a team that I think will fit up fit our scheme very well. We got this Lashawn McCoy. So he's probably the high one of our higher overall um, linemen. Ooh, we got Ted Hendricks here. So that's good. We got Ted Hendricks. So we got players we could use for sure. Um, Lashawn McCoy. Let's see how much he's going for. He's going for about 9k, so honestly, we're just going to keep him. So, I think what we got to do now is look for look for um, our type of... Uh, oh, they got chemistry here. D-tackle, secondary position. Um, These are uh, these are all new. I haven't seen any of this. But we're looking for just... Um, Oh, core team items, right. So, let's go defense. How do you search up the defense? Let's see. Chemistry? No. Quality? No. That doesn't change anything. Oh, we don't even have money to buy stuff. Well, we could either buy the Cardinals or Browns defense. So, that's... 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 Okay, you know. Um, so, how do we see our auctions if anything has been bought? Yo, my auctions is the same as always, right? These two are sitting here. Our first two players being sold for the year. Um, okay. So we're going to do generate best lineup. 
and um, see what overall we get. You know, because like I said, this is no money spent. We're not gonna go, not gonna go buying players to be better. We go up to 78 overall. We have a guy named Colby Gassett, Trevor Munford, Daniel Brunskill, Cesar Ruiz, who has to play at that right tackle position. Kenny Pickett and RG3. Receivers aren't that fast, but we have a good amount of receivers though. Okay. And then defense. We have Deion Jones and Jermaine Pratt. Okay. Okay. Night Train Lane. Legere Saint. So we need corners. We need corners bad. Special teams. Oh my gosh. We we need to change up a lot of things, but there's not much we could do. Unless unless someone wants to get sold, right? Eleven minutes later. All right, so we finally got both those guys to sell. We have about forty k to work with. You guys remember what the team looked like when we generated the best slam? So we're lacking at some positions like left tackle, uh, guard, tight end, all that. So let's go try to find some key players on the auction block with our forty k. So left tackle position, I see that we could go for about pretty high here. Because obviously at that position, we want to have someone that can protect our guy. So they got a guy named Dan Moore, 85 overall. He's a zero chill elite player. Never really heard of him, but his stats look pretty good. All around the 80s, he has great run block too. Um, he only has 61 speed. But Dan Moore is looking like an option here as a power left tackle for us. Then there's also Joe Thomas. Or also Charles Cross, actually, the rookie. I just want to kind of go with like speed at that left tackle position. So he has 71 speed. His run block's like whatever, but that 71 speed will work out big in our favor. So we're going to go with Charles Cross. I like to spend a good amount of a chunk of change for the left tackle position because that is our most important one. So we're going to pick that up. Or most important on the offensive line because he's blocking the blind side of the Kenny Pickett. So we picked up Charles Cross. So perfect for us. And um, now let's see if we could get a, maybe like a, another corner. So I see Derek Stingley Jr. He's pretty, he's pretty, he was pretty good in college. He has good speed. Um, I think he could be really good for us. So I, I'm gonna pick him up. All right, next player we're getting is Tutu Atwell. Seems like a budget beast. He has 89 speed. I think he'll be our fastest guy on the team, and he can also kick return too. So he can help us out in the deep threats when we're gonna try to just launch the rock, of course. Another player we're gonna get is Thomas Davis Sr. He's a pass coverage linebacker that we're gonna put in the back of our defense because you know we're running a 4-3. So it's gonna be looking pretty good. I'm liking where where we're at right now. Uh, one more position I'm thinking of maybe looking at is maybe getting like a solid kicker. Like I don't want to. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm not trying to lose a game off of just like a missed kick. So we're gonna pick up a kicker and that'll be our last purchase. So we're doing best team overall. We came out in 80 now. So now team is looking a bit better. Two twos here. CD Lamb, Kenny Pickett. Uh, tight end position will be a little bit, uh, a little bit weak, but defense though, Night Train Lane, Legere Sneed, and uh, Derek Stingley, um, Thomas Davis is an 85 at that other side. Why is Ted Hendricks playing both positions? Do we not have inside linebacker? What? Why is Ted Hendricks playing every position? Do we not have players? <laughs> like, what is that? Um, okay, well, strategy. Our defense will be definitely be our 4-3 right and then i guess we still have to use some of our coins to pick up uh the rest of the positions from the looks of it because i mean i don't know why ted hendrix has to play every position but we're gonna have to fill that in but for the meantime this is what we came up with next episode will be game one and we're gonna see how this no money spent squad will perform if you guys want to see more, hit the like button, subscribe for new, comment down below if you're new to the channel, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. And remember, you got to be a fiend to succeed. Peace.